Thanks for watching. So we've done a lot of duck calling videos and we figured we'd throw it into goose because the first thing you start out doing throughout the year is goose call. And we're just gonna do a very basic honk and show you new beginners how to do it. I have a short read goose call, it's an MG Rush. I absolutely love it. So essentially what I'm gonna do is do the honk. And the way that you put together a goose note is kind of like the way you put it out for a duck, except there is absolutely no voice inflection in your throat. The way I'm going to be doing it is with cold air. So it's like you're blowing out uh, candles on a birthday cake. So it's a... Uh, same thing with a duck call, to cut off the note, you use the meaty part of your tongue. So you have your tongue anchored against the back part of your teeth on the bottom level and you force out air. So I'm gonna kinda go through the first noise you're gonna hear and that is a And you notice how it's really high pitched and all that. Notice how I'm also not putting my hands over the call like you would for a normal goose call, just to not confuse you guys, because that really confused me. You should be able to do all your notes without having your hand over the call. So you should be able to do a you should be able to do that without having your hands on the call. The only difference is, just for the sake of teaching and for you learning, you want to learn how to do it the right way. And I know a lot of guys who can break over the reed, but only with their hands on the call, and that's not the right way to do it. For me teaching you how to do this, I'm going to do it in the back of the call so I can show you the kind of air I'm presenting. You can hear my tongue cutting off the note, so I'm not just really going... I'm not using the back of my throat, I'm just blowing it out like a birthday candle. In the front of the call, it's gonna sound like <laughs> The last note I did there was a cluck, and that's without the moan in front of it. Damn near every single note will stem from this. That first part of the call is called the moan. That's without me breaking over the reed. What I'm doing there is I'm having my tongue sitting as low as I can in my mouth. So this is just the normal. Hear how it's going up and down, up and down, but it's not breaking over the reed. It doesn't break over the reed until I force air over my tongue. This is really hard if you've never blown a short reed goose call, but once you get that down without your hands over it, every other note will go so much faster. So with my hands without the call, and I bring my hand closer to it, I'm not blowing any different, that's just my hands are adding it as like a tuning board, just like when you're going like this with a duck call. So the hands are important, but just for the sake of learning how to do the note properly, don't use your hands starting out. Thanks for watching guys, be sure to like our stuff on Instagram and Facebook, and be sure to subscribe to us on YouTube. Thanks for watching.